was a release watcher. That's the movie review for the 1980 film The Jazz Singer, which is starring the musician Neil Diamond. That being said, let's get started with the good. So I thought the story was very fun. It wasn't anything too unique, but I still did, did enjoy the story nonetheless. I also thought the characters were, were very great. I thought Neil, Neil Diamond did a very good performance in the film. Apparently he wasn't a very good actor, but I thought he did a very good performance. I thought he was a very good actor in the film. There were some other great characters as well for the film, but he, he was probably my favourite. I also thought the songs in the film were, were, fan, were fantastic. I don't want to spoil the songs, but I think it's worth watching the film just for the songs alone. There, there, there's some brilliant songs in there. Um, I also thought it was paced very well. I didn't feel like there were any scenes I was sat there bored. I felt like I was enjoying pretty much the entire film. I also thought it had emotional scenes and I thought they were done very well as well. Uh, and also, I thought it was quite funny in some parts. There were some parts that it didn't make me crack up laughing, but it did definitely put a smile on my face. But now let's move on to the bad for the film. There's not really much really bad about it. The only problem I really found was there, there were a couple of scenes that probably could have been done better. But I do feel like this just was a near perfect film in my opinion. This is probably a very unpopular opinion. Because I looked at the reviews and most people giving it like a 7 out of 10. But I, I honestly thought it was a, an amazing film. And I was very pleasant surprised. wasn't expecting to find much on the film. But... Overall, I, I would recommend it for people who like Neil Diamond music or just like films with songs in in general. And I would rate the film a 9 out of 10. Uh, I, I thought, like, like I said, it was a near perfect film. I enjoyed it pretty much all the way through. I would definitely highly recommend it. And I'm definitely going to watch it again. I don't know when I'll watch it again, but we'll, we'll just have to wait and see. But that's it for the very short review of The Jazz Singer. I also want to quickly mention that you, you should listen to Neil Diamond music. It's it's amazing. It, it's, it's not just Sweet Sweet Caroline, in my opinion. It is a great song, but I, I, don't, want you to, I don't want you to think of Neil Diamond as that's all he sings. There's so many other amazing songs he sings. And I, 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 I might say that Sweet Caroline isn't even in my top five favourite Neil Diamond song, so I would recommend to watch this film and listen to some more Neil Diamond music if you have not. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you guys on Thursday for my next video. Anyway, until then, ciao.